Hello everybody and today I'm going to be talking about the best ways of how to deal with the oppressor mark 2 griefers. I want to say something before we start this. I highly recommend you not to waste time on that because that's exactly what they want. They're sad people, they're looking for attention and this is their way of getting attention or maybe they're having a bad day and they want to take it out on you. So always remember that you could be doing something much better like making money or something else other than fighting with a Mark II griefer which is basically what they do 24-7 and you're gonna gain literally nothing out of it even if you win the battle and you know how it is if you kill a killer the number of killers won't change which means you're gonna be just like them if you do the exact the same thing that they're doing so if you see a griefer just find another session where no griefers will be around you or go to invite only session where nobody else will be they are other than you or the people you're going to invite and just enjoy the game and do something else and don't forget you can enable the passive mode and one more thing don't think that all the oppressor mark 2 players are the griefers because personally i use this vehicle because it's the fastest way to move around the map a compact vehicle can be parked anywhere you can get an immediate delivery from the motorcycle club and if you want to avoid any type of conflict always turn off the homing rocket so you don't accidentally aim somebody and that's gonna make them think that you are going after them so now let's talk about the best ways of encountering these people the first way is the oppressor mark to itself this is one of the situations you know if you can't beat them join them thing oppressor mark 2 ironically is weak against another oppressor mark 2 make sure you have these chaff countermeasures installed on your mark 2 because when you deploy these other players won't be able to aim with their lock on rocket for a few seconds anymore and you will have enough time to kill them and you should activate this before you go too close to them and there's gonna be a short delay before you can fire another one also don't forget to go off the radar by calling Lester or activating the ghost organization in your CEO abilities which will make you even more annoying because they cannot see you on the radar and probably they're going to do the same since you know they try hard so second way to deal with them is the Imani tech which comes with the agency building make sure you have the vehicle workshop upgrade and uh, only certain vehicles has this like the champion here or the buffalo stx and i highly recommend you to get the buffalo stx the champion is a better car when you drive it compared to the stx but the thing is it's useless in races and buffalo stx is the new best muscle car to use in races around the track not on the drag race and it will be much more useful to have so we got this imani tech right here with the rocket lock on jammer check the video in the description if you want to where i have linked eight reasons why you should be having a buffalo stx if you're interested in this car so this car will need 12 homing rockets to get destroyed but homing rockets as i said when you have the imani tech installed will not work anymore so they have to manually aim you and most of the griefers will leave you alone because they're too lazy oppressor mark 2 has 20 homing rockets just in case you don't know that third way to deal with the mark 2 griefers is the mobile operator center this truck right here is an absolute monster it needs if i'm not wrong 70 homie rockets to get destroyed one good thing about this truck is that it's fast and the bad thing is it has horrible brakes just like any other truck in this game you can actually use this truck as the vip work mission called whole edge and annoy them while you're making some money you'll get paid around twenty thousand dollars on that vip work when you finish it so yeah if you need a safe vehicle where no mark II griefers can touch you this is a good way and um also you won't be able to shoot any explosives out of this so keep that in mind that if an armored kiruma comes after you that will be a complete nightmare <laughs> because the only things you are able to shoot from here are the you know regular weapons like ap pistol and stuff like that fourth best way to deal with the mark II griefers is the night shark night shark can take 20 26 homing rockets before it gets destroyed and it has this weapon right here you can weaponize this car so you don't break the window 
those anymore but it's just this weapon is useless and you'll probably start shooting even if you have the weapon and this is what the weapons do to your windows you are breaking your own windows so it's not really a bullet resistant unless you upgrade the armor plating but then you won't be able to shoot anything else other than this stock weapon anymore from this car which is a bad idea in my case so bullet resistance is just like any other car when you have no armor plating but rocket resistance is very good another good thing you can do is get the insurgent pickup custom instead if you have a friend who will help you with that vehicle it has a very strong machine gun on it and you too can actually shoot and drive and that car also has very good rocket resistance oppressor mark 2 will not be able to destroy you with the 20 rockets insurgent pickup custom has the same rocket resistance it can take 26 homing rockets now let's go back to the night shark this is a pretty fast car for its size and has a very good acceleration and it can do off-roading very well fifth way to deal with the griefers is the toreador right here this car will need six homing rockets to get destroyed so if you get out the game or if you get lucky enough you will have enough time to kill the player who's coming after you this car has unlimited amount of homing rockets and it can swim it has the machine gun and it has this boost which can even be used under the water toreador is absolutely one of the must have vehicles in the game and also one of the best ways to deal with a mark 2 griefers number six is the rc vehicles the rc bandito or the rc tank because they are always off the radar the moment you get them. Thing is, you can't get detected from the homing rockets because homing rockets are detecting the RC vehicles. But in case your Mark II gets destroyed and you have to wait for a new request, a new delivery, you can go ahead and go off the radar with these and hide from them or you just, you know, stay off the radar and they cannot find you anymore. Here's another similar way of this, the Acula helicopter which has homing rockets and it has stealth mode which means this helicopter can go off the radar for unlimited amount of time you can sneak up to the mark 2 players shoot them a homing rocket and then go off the radar again without them knowing what happened this helicopter can take two homing rockets before it gets destroyed and also has this uh bomb dropping thing right here and since oppressor mark 2 is not fast enough to catch most of the helicopters Acula will evade them and last thing I can tell is get a jet most common things to encounter them with the jet is the laser or the hydra and you can actually steal the laser from the military base these have the explosive machine gun but they also have the homing rockets and once you see a rocket is coming after you you can just go ahead and fly on circles as you've seen in a video right now and as long as you are going to be flying on the circles no homing rockets will be able to hit you weakness of the jets is that they're fragile so an explosive sniper is a complete nightmare for them but you can fight against them with your homing rockets and their homing rockets cannot touch you and also don't forget to report the griefers this will not do much but it's better than nothing so you just pause the game go to online section then find players right here and when you go here find their name and they will probably have the high kd ratio because you know they're griefing all the people not just you so select their name then press enter and you're gonna see report option right here press that and your report has submitted don't forget to always report these people because they are ruining the experience for everybody and that was all for today's video i hope this was helpful thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe